It's the Royal Family Show. It's your boy, Dick Bo, and we back again. The Royal Family with my boy, DVR, and Sick, the King. You know, I call myself the King. I don't want to offend nobody. You know, there's a lot of haters out there, but I don't care. I'm still the King. Y'all remember that. I'm Dick Bo, the General. We're bringing this shit to y'all all the time via the website. Y'all gonna see the website, it's gonna be coming soon. Please look out for it. But right now, just keep checking this out right now on this internet. But uh, we gonna talk about whatever y'all wanna talk about and whatever the fuck we feel like talking about. This is the internet show that does real talk for real motherfuckers, real shit, every damn day. Every day. Right now, our topic of discussion, we just happened to just come up with this one, is lazy motherfuckers. There's some lazy motherfuckers in this world. I know a lot of lazy people. And <laughs> we gonna speak on it. Okay. Now, you know you lazy when you stay with when you stay with your mama and you're 47. Word. That's lazy. Or you stay with your baby mama and you're 47. That's lazy. Oh. And you ain't even with your baby mama no more. Or you know when you lazy when you dream about wait about working and when you wake up you're tired. That's lazy, motherfucker. You're lazy. Get up, get out, do something. There should be no reason a grown-ass man is not providing for himself or his family. You know or a woman. Yeah, all woman too. You see, but but for me, I'm not I'm not trying to make it, you know, put men and women on a different different standard. But if you a man. You know, you should get up and go to work anyway. Whether she going to work or not. I mean, don't get me wrong, you got to lay it. Now, if, you ain't, if you're a woman, you ain't working, when I come home, I want my house clean. I want rice and gravy. Don't, don't make me no dry rice. Look, I want rice and gravy. Look, women, I'm going to let y'all know. You got a man. Yep. This is how I know you lazy, no motherfucker. You got a man. He go to work, pay the bills, go on and get the crib going, got the little rod out there. Y'all ain't starving anymore. If your ass order McDonald's, you the lazy motherfucker. Oh, oh, oh. You been in the house all motherfucking day. The niggas out at work slaving from a nine to five and come home to a microwavable dinner. Bitch, that's lazy. Make me some oodles and noodles or something. Got the hey, oodles, got the bitch. You lazy for the oodles and noodles. You, you got the chop. I need the three minutes, good man. man. And put the gravy on the rice. You take time to I'm on mad potatoes. Give me some damn, give me some sustenance. I need something to eat. Look, there's only three things. I, I'm going to tell you this. There's only three things I need from a woman. I got no low man. Check it out. And then three F's. The fuck me, feed me, and shut the fuck up. Bang. If you, you ain't got to do them all every day, and you ain't got to do it in order. Just give me mine. See, see, I, I, I would totally different breed of person. You know, I'm different. Hey, I ain't got to have sex every day. I like it. Yeah. I want to eat every day. Make sure I got food on the table. Okay, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm talking about. Especially I, if I'm putting the goddamn ribs in the freezer. Man, I be grazing the motherfuckers. I work 40 hours a week, full-time student, and a full-time father. There should be no reason I can't come home to a hot cook meal every day. Look, and on top of that, he see he left out something. And we got a full-time business. What y'all seeing right now, this is business. It's not yes. playing. It's not like we're just joking around. We're playing with fucking video cameras. You might have this fun. Is this is work we're doing right now. There's nothing funny about this. You know, see, see, you got on, you know, women. I'm, I'm going to talk about men in here for a minute. Yeah, bring, you speak you know you lazy as hell if you... And your significant other, or whoever you stay with, is in the same house. And you call them and say, hey, yo, can you fix me some Kool-Aid? Get your lazy ass up and get your own Kool-Aid. Oh, how about this? When you sitting down watching motherfucking TV, too lazy to get up and change the channel, you want somebody else to find a remote control for you. That's lazy, lazy as a motherfucker. That's lazy. That's, that's, that's crying shame. And y'all turn your kids into being lazy. Cause they see your ways, man. You always call, hey, Joe, Joe, where the remote at? His dad's gonna get laid too. He get tired. You always come up here. Daddy always want me to change the chair. Motherfucker, do not call your kids lazy when you're lazy because they are a product of their environment. Meaning, they gonna go out and be lazy because that's what they see mommy and daddy doing, being lazy. Man, stand up on your own. Hey, you got some lazy ass kids out there. Man, you got fat lazy as a motherfucker. Look, this bitch in the 
generation. I'm, I'm gonna tell you, you talk about this generation. I'm gonna talk about my generation now. That when we was growing up, we stayed outside. Let I me stayed go. Outside. No, let me get a raise of hands. How you had dishwashing in the house? Growing up, we didn't have no dishwashing. You know we didn't have an AC unit. We had one air conditioner in one window in one part. That's what I'm talking about. Kids these days. My, I, I got kids. My kids be upset to do the dishes. I got a brand new dishwasher. I'm not just talking about a dishwasher. I got a brand new dishwasher. That motherfucker got a warranty on that motherfucker. And my kids don't want to put the dishes in the dishwasher. That is so lazy, 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 lazy motherfucker. I, I, I keep it real. I got a brand new dishwasher. It's so new. I've been in my house a year and a half. It still got plastic in there. Because it's not getting you. Word. Washing dishes. Still. You gonna wash them man. But house. see, see, this is what I know. Now see, we didn't talk about the niggas. I'm finna get back on these bitches. I was fucking this bitch. Bitch so lazy, we talking about washing dishes. She had China in the house, but kept buying paper plates. What the fuck? And then didn't want to take the trash out. After the paper plates filled the trash can. That's you lazy. Motherfucking lazy. You lazy. Lazy. I'm, I'm, I'm still, I'm still on these kids, man. Like, like, if you sit back, you look at this generation now that we, we lost. All kids want to do is play PlayStation and Xbox and the, the Wii. That's what I want to do, too. That's what I want to do, too. work no more. Yo, that's why they call America the fattest country on this planet. Because motherfuckers is too late. And because it ain't that we get, because it's getting easier and easier. Like you say, when we was little, we had none of that shit. So you you want to do Atari or Nintendo. No. Before that, no. we had our imagination. Now yeah. they got so much shit. If you had to do a paper or you had to do a research, your ass in the library looking at big ass books this thick. Now they got now the internet. Click. One click and you don't found everything you need so you got time to play the game. Yeah, a motherfucking book looked like a three foot midget. That's the shit I'm talking about. That's the shit we used to read. Motherfuckers is just playing out lazy. We, we, we talking about lazy people for a reason. Now, if you know you lazy as a motherfucker, if you're a mechanic and you go get an oil change. Woo! You lazy as a motherfucker. Lazy. There ain't no damn reason you ain't changing lazy. your oil. We went, from, we went from typewriters to printers. That's a whole different subject right there. See, That's lazy. It, it, it's like we, we not trying to take shots at everybody. Nope. Because everybody have laziness. You know, sometimes I get tired. I don't want to do things too. But some of you are ridiculous, man. You, your people, hey, y'all need to... I, I can't even tell you what you need to do, because only you know what you right. need to do. Hey, sit, let me, uh, let me further elaborate on that. You think up and bitch is not lazy or tired because he's lazy. He's tired from all the extra work you got to do. If I got to walk three miles to go to work, then that's something I got to do, just because I had bus fare. I does that shit. Motherfuckers call a lot of work, and they live right across the street from their job, because they don't feel like going oh, to oh, 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 oh. I call, I call out of work, you know. <laughs> if y'all watching this, I'm sick right now. <laughs> you know, but hey, drinking a beer. Did I just take a beer? This right here, my cough medicine. Yeah, that's still cool in that can. Robo Tussin. <laughs> but look, lazy motherfuckers, get up off your ass. Get up out. Get up. Get out and do something. Yes. Just, 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 just do that. If you don't do nothing else, if, if not for you, for the generation under you, especially if you got kids. So, so we're gonna hit it. We're gonna hit it like this right here. We're, we're not asking for much. No. Nope. Man, a little effort goes far. Yeah. So the only thing we want y'all to do is to put in the effort, man. You yeah. know, just get off the ass, put in the effort. Don't tell, don't tell your, your old lady or your husband that you're going to look for a job and you just go next door and play PlayStation. That shit ain't cool. That's